Welcome, dear parents of Thakur Bhagwani Devi Musafir Public School. I am Mrs. Seema Prasad, the headmistress of primary section here. I am delighted to host our orientation program today. Let's begin by understanding the mission and vision that our school stands by and which is formulated on the ideals of our guiding light, captain of our ship, none other than our trustee sir, Shri Jitain Singh Ji. Who believes in the mantra that don't limit your challenges, challenge your limit. He guides us towards excellence and growth and leads us to explore innovative avenues. Our vision at TBMPS is to become an institution of excellence, fostering sound ethical values and academic achievement in a secure and nurturing environment. When we emphasize a safe and nurturing environment parent, we truly mean it. We uphold stringent safety protocols both within and outside our school premises. Our classrooms and campus are equipped with CCTV cameras and our well-trained staff adhere to all safety norms, including disaster management procedures also. We regularly conduct safety drills, fire drills, and evacuation exercises. Now, speaking of our mission, Education at TBMPS is a relentless pursuit of excellence aiming for the comprehensive development of each student's personality and potential, be it academic, spiritual, moral, social, or physical, or key endeavors. We are deeply committed to the holistic development of our students. We provide various opportunities for them to enhance their cognitive skills through diverse activities, competitions, and examinations. Spiritual development is integral to our school. We celebrate all festivals with great zeal be it Janmashtami, Rakshabandhan, Ganpati, Diwali, Christmas, Onam, Lori, Eid, and many more. We not only impart values, but also instill them through skits, story narrations, and unique festival celebrations. For instance, parents, during Guru Purnima, we not only teach our students to respect their gurus, but we also invited parents to join us so the students can recognize their crucial role as the first guru in their life. To nurture moral and social responsibilities in our students, we organize activities like Joy of Giving, where our students share gifts with the underprivileged kids. Physical development is as vital as our mental growth. We offer a range of outdoor interactive activities with trained coaches and they guide our students. We conduct sports events, celebrate yoga day and provide training in athletics and various sports to ensure the all right development of our kids. Now I will introduce the driving force behind our institution, our pillar of strength inspiring and dynamic personality, none other than our director and principal of TRPS, Dr. Pinky Tripathi. She is a visionary leader who guides us with her innovative ideas. Dr. Tripathi firmly believes that a happy school leads to happy teachers and consequently happy students. Her unwavering support empowers us to explore new horizons and strive for excellence. Let me now share the batch timings of our primary section, which operates in the afternoon shift. The timings for grade 1 to 5 are from 1 p.m. to 6 p.m. We have 20 minutes break during which students will have their snacks. Regarding the school office timings, parents, the office is open until 5 p.m. If you wish to meet the headmistress, we recommend schedule an appointment to ensure we can provide you with 
undivided attention and avoid any inconveniences. Though we have an upper door policy parents, appointment allow us to allocate proper time to address your concerns effectively. But in case of emergency or urgent matters, please know that you are always welcome to meet us without an appointment. Though we have open door policy, appointments allow us to allocate proper time to address your concerns effectively. However, in case of emergency or some urgent matters, please know that you are always welcome to meet us without an appointment too. Parents, you can see the academic subjects of our primary grades on the screen. Uh, for grades 1 and 2, the subjects are English, Hindi, Marathi, Maths and EVS that is Environmental Science. Moving on to grade 3, 4 and 5, we introduce Social Studies in addition to English, Hindi, Marathi, Maths and Science. We have an interactive learning approach, parents. We emphasize on learning by doing. Our teaching methods include innovative techniques. Like when we teach about plants in our science lectures, we take the students to our school garden. Or the language teacher, they teach our students in language lab. And even for the art and craft, our teachers, they they teach them the activity-based lesson and they engage the students effectively. We have projectors available in each classroom and our teachers incorporate technology to deliver dynamic and interactive lessons. Parents will receive a detailed class timetable before the school reopens. Now let's explore the non-academic or co-curricular subjects that plays very important role in our holistic development of the, of the students. We believe in providing a platform for students to discover and showcase their hidden talents and encouraging them to broaden their horizons and break boundaries. Our director, Dr. Pinky Tripathi, has introduced Talking Titans, a platform that empower every child to express their thoughts and ideas on stage. Parents are co-curricular subjects include art, dance, music, computer studies, physical education, general knowledge, life skills, and an exciting addition that is robotics. In robotics program, students are introduced to the fascinating world of artificial intelligence and coding from a young age. Our CC activity schedule is meticulously planned in advance to ensure a balanced and enriching experience for our students. When it comes to life skills, we focus on nurturing independence and self-reliance in our students. We teach them the basic concepts like uh, and basic course like making their bed, arranging their study table, preparing sandwiches, laminate, because we aim to equip our students with essential skills, life skills, to become, they will become the independent and confident citizens. Parents, we have our indoor gym khana, which is equipped with various indoor games, and we give training for outdoor games too, and sports like athletics, football, cricket coaching, etc. For art, we have a well equipped art studio where students they learn different techniques in art and craft. We have dance studio, music studio too, where our well trained teachers they teach our students. Now let's check our assessment pattern. 
we have a structured approach to evaluate our students progress we conduct lsrw test every week lsrw stands for listening speaking reading and writing this test consists of objective questions just as just as fill in the blanks or short answer the marks obtained from these tests will contribute to the final scores to parents it's important to note that there will be no re exam for lsrw test addition to that this test we have unit test worth 20 marks each and we have two semester semester 1 and semester 2 that carries 40 marks the syllabus for these assessments will be provided well in advance and our teachers will explain the paper pattern to our students as well as to parents also we will organize the session for the parents where our teachers will explain all the paper pattern and the marking scheme too parents assessment uh, attendance is compulsory it's mandatory the child has to attend the exams addition to this we incorporate project based learning also and that is also evaluated to ensure that our students are well prepared we also conduct surprise test and revision sessions in school revision sessions we conduct in a very unique way um, we have circle time where one teacher is delivering the lesson and the another group of teacher they provide personalized attention to students and they assist them while they were writing and they make them understand the concept they see that whether the students are writing properly they understand and that our students are well prepared and confident before the exams let's discuss the details of our project a very important part in our curriculum but this academic year parents we have organized projects on a monthly basis and the schedule is already available in our albany for grades 1 to 5 the project schedule for may month that will focus on language development students will be provided with specific content to read and review and then they will write their own project based on the material provided with this approach this will not only fosters a habit of reading but also enhances vocabulary and comprehension skills this year the project schedule is divided from may to september our aim is to complete all projects by the end of the september month parents if you have any queries or require additional information regarding the projects feel free to contact us because all projects will be conducted in school under the guidance and supervision of our specialized teachers i would like to highlight the importance of the important pages in our almanac that is page number 17 24 25 26 to 47 64 65 72 80 and 81 which is given in the almanac these pages are crucial as they contain vital information such as exam dates reopening dates and yearly planning parents this year a new addition is there that is called remark page which is aimed at fostering discipline among our students teachers will provide the remarks for instance like forgetting books if they have improper uniform or untidy uniform or for their misbehavior if a student accumulates three remarks they will be referred to the higher authorities and appropriate action will be taken against them parents it is very essential to check the almanac regularly to stay updated with what's happening in the school please ensure that your child comes to school neatly dressed with the required books and materials to maintain a conducive learning environment for all uniform 
plays a significant role in maintaining the discipline and decorum of our school. We expect all students to come to school in a clean, neat and crisp uniform along with clean shoes. But during the rainy season, students are required to wear the prescribed black floaters as displayed on the screen. And once the rainy season is over, students should revert to wearing black shoes with their regular uniform and white shoes with their P uniform. As you can see on the screen parents, there is a winter wear also. So students are prepared to wear navy blue sweaters only during the winter season. Please ensure adherence to these uniform guidelines to maintain uniformity and discipline throughout the school. Parents, to keep you informed and connected, we utilize Google Classroom as our primary communication platform. You will receive a Google Classroom link which upon clicking you will become a part of the Google Classroom. This platform serves as a hub for daily synopsis, providing insight into classroom activities, homework and other school related events. Additionally, we have introduced the EduSprint app. This is an app which we will explain in detail during separate sessions for parents. This app will also allow you to assess daily synopsis. You can view circulars and you can even check your child's attendance, fee payments, etc. Both Google Classroom and EduSprint app are integral tools for communication and efficient functioning of our school. Parents, we encourage you to stay active and engaged on these platforms to stay updated with your child's academic journey. Let's discuss our remedial classes. These classes are not exclusively for weak students but are designed for those who need additional support to strengthen their understanding of certain topics. The aim is to provide personalized attention and reinforce the foundational concepts to help students to catch up with their peers. Parents, these remedial classes are not compulsory at all for all students after careful observation and assessment by our teachers, a list of students who would benefit from these classes will be compiled. Parents of the selected students will be notified accordingly. It's important to note that these classes are free of cost, thanks to an initiative by our management. We are pleased to offer bus transportation facility for our students. The priority is the safety of our students and their convenience. Each bus will have a designated lead to oversee the route and ensure the well-being of our students. We'll have a lady attended in each bus parents. For more information regarding bus routes, fees and other details, please contact the school office. When it comes to absenteeism parents, uh, consistent attendance is crucial for a student's academic success. Every student must have at least 80% attendance to appear in half yearly or annual examination. If a student is absent for two consecutive days or more, the parents must send an official intimation, intimation to the school authorities and submit a medical certificate if it is applicable. If your child is unable to attend school due to illness or any other reason, please notify the school by sending an application or an email explaining the absence. We appreciate your cooperation in ensuring that your child attends school regularly and that any absence are promptly communicated to us.
we have canteen facility available for students who may require it uh, while we encourage students to bring homemade healthy food for their break we understand that some may prefer to avail the canteen facilities too but to utilize the canteen facility parents you all have to purchase food coupons available in the school office and the students can use these coupons to avail the canteen facility please note that cash transactions will not be accepted we will share weekly canteen menu through our whatsapp group to keep parents informed additionally we will provide guidelines on packing healthy and nutritious meals for our students to bring in their tiffin boxes students are required to bring their notebooks textbook id card to school daily additionally they should carry their almanac tiffin with healthy food and water bottle if students are unable to bring their own tiffin they can avail the canteen services but with using the food coupons it's important to note that students should have the necessary stationery with them parents will advise please do not give them the fancy stationery fancy pens compass box heavy metal bottles costly pens please avoid this we encourage parents to avoid unnecessary expenses and focus on teaching the value of simplicity and practically to our students PTA the parent teacher association plays a crucial role in fostering a collaborative and supportive environment between parents and the school we encourage all parents to actively participate in PTA as it serves a platform for two way communication as active member of PTA parents are invited to share their ideas suggestions and feedback on areas of improvement parents your insights are invaluable to us and we are committed to addressing any concern or suggestions raised during these meetings additionally pta can assist in organizing school events workshops and by working together we can create a positive and enriching experience for our students we expect the pta to serve as a bridge between parents and the school and facilitating open communication parents we look forward to your active participation and contributions to our pta meetings and initiatives parents we will be having the whatsapp group great wise but that will be one way communication only the group only the school can communicate with the parents because but for pta groups we will be having two way communication that group will be active only for pta members parents we hope that we have provided you with all the essential information for the upcoming academic year if you have any queries or questions please feel free to type them in comment section below the comment section will remain open for one hour we kindly request you to review the previous chat as you may find your answer to your question there also wishing you all a successful and rewarding academic year ahead thank you for your patience and we look forward to a fruitful and enriching journey together thank you dear parents